This happened yesterday mm -hmm. during our newscast yes. when Mario was reading a story. Correct. By the way, she didn't stick to the prompter. She was <laughs> ad-libbing throughout the story. From personal knowledge. Okay, and so we were talking about aliens. Uh, hashtag the noon if you'd like to talk about it again. But uh, it's one of those things where... <laughs> I just had to. I just had to back off and go. I need to let this conversation happen without you me don't. because I've never seen an alien. I've never seen uh, anything in the sky that wasn't a drone. Uh, I don't have any yes, knowledge you have, of aliens. Lee. What? You've seen the videos. You have now seen videos from the Department of Defense that are saying we, this. This is they nothing just saying, that we know. They're just saying they don't know what it is. I guess we're doing. We're doing this again. Yeah, let's do it. They're just saying they don't know what it is. That's what they're saying. They don't they're, know what no, that they're is. They're saying this is not technology. That they. They know of. Global. There's countries all over the world that have technology. Talk to you, boy. There's okay. yeah, so there's countries all over the world that have the same technology that we have on Earth. But that is not to say that another civilization from another planet doesn't have better technology. We're really doing this again? That's, Listen. That's what the Department Derek of Defense Kevra, is Derek Kevra, seri he's serious. And he's I, science -y. I, 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 Okay, I'd I'm like, let him go. Go okay, ahead. So I'd like to, I'd like to revisit this, the, the dark forest theory Please. here. So okay. can, can you stick with me for three points? I will do my best. All right, yeah. point number one. All life desires to stay alive. Absolutely. Great. Point number two. There is no way to know if another life form will destroy you or be friendly to you if given the chance. You don't know. You don't it's know until you other. know. That's right. correct. That's we like correct. to assume it's friendly. We cannot assume that it's friendly because the galaxy is not of limitless resources. There are, we like to think there are. Oh, there's everything. everybody's got water. Everybody's got food. That is not, that is not known to be true. Therefore, the first thing that a civilization that is stronger than you technologically will do mm. is kill you. Mm -hmm. That is point number three, by the way. So that that's the dark forest the theory. Yes, the safest, uh, no, no, no. So that is what, that is, that is the theory of that like, if we interact with another life form, that we are not safe. Right. Therefore, right. Right. the dark forest theory is our best bet is to stay hidden and yes. quiet in the shadows of the dark forest. Unfortunately, we have I already sent a map. All of our signals are just flying out there through space that they could pick up. Which is television signals, no, radio signals. We have signals. sent a map of the universe. Oh, we did that as well. Yeah, legit. We, with we a, had that. We are here. On. We yeah. had we uh, Dakota Tyler come on and talk about the fact that there's a we are here map for anybody to find at any point. And I think Stephen Hawking said, that's a bad idea. Terrible because idea. Because all we can do is send out the, te the information. Can't get them back though. What they can do is receive it, then come find us and take whatever it is they want. And if they can hear us and we cannot hear them, it implies that they are more technologically superior, which makes them more dangerous. And because there are not limitless resources, mm. they're gonna take what they want. Period. How about on a much smaller scale? Please. The dark forest again. Yes. If you are a hunter, I'm not a hunter, but if you are a hunter, what do you do? You hunt. go in your blind and you stay quiet and you listen for the prey to come <clears throat> out. And, and that's us. Get it. Big doofy. Oh, oh, we're the prey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're Come the only ones back here. Wait, is this oh, French hey, my name is Lee Thomas. No, I don't believe checking, in aliens. I'm just checking with everybody <laughs> out there. Yeah. Right, I'm just checking with everybody out there. This is really happening, it right? It is. This is real life right now. Yeah. This discussion. You're talk, yes, you're yes. talking about alien life forms and we should stay hidden. Yeah. All the planets. All the new discoveries. Listen. Do you not find it to be suspicious that suddenly Space Force is a thing? Suddenly NASA is in the national news every other day saying, hey, now we know this test was successful. By the way, we didn't tell you it was really a planetary defense strategy. And now we know it works, so we're good here. You don't think that's, like, you just see it on the news and you're like, oh, let me go on about my day, because I'm Lee Thomas and there's no <laughs> such thing does, as aliens. Why does Lee and Thomas like, have his arms go like that? No, this is your feet. Yeah. Oh, my feet. Oh, 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 oh my feet are walking, because yeah. I'm, I'm just walking around right, making a lot of noise. noise. A lot aliens of are in the wood forest. and you're the prey and you're like, oh, is that a berry? <laughs> is this a poisonous oh. berry? There this are story. bigger problems in the berries, in the bushes. By the way, I don't sound like that either. Just for the just for the record. <laughs> just for the record, I just uh, this but whole conversation. Like Does it at least? That question. Uh, Do you think yeah. it's odd? Do you think anything of the fact that suddenly this is in the news all the time? We're talking about space. NASA's super concerned. We have a space force now. Jeff Bezos is out here going crazy, going in outer space, sitting William Shatner. Now he's sad. He may, maybe he saw something. Can I? Can, can, oh, go ahead. Answer, answer her question first. Is yeah, yes or no? I, yes. <laughs> mm. The yeah. answer is yes. 
this whole last three minutes has been very odd. Mm. Yeah, I got one more thing for <laughs> that's you. All, you think that's, that's all odd. I can say. You think that's <laughs> odd. So water, very important here on Earth. Mm. You know what else is very advantageous about our solar system? Tell what? Me. We got one sun. Mm. That is a very important detail because everything is very organized. We know when our seasons start, we know what we're gonna get, we know when it's gonna be hot, when it's gonna be cold. Other solar systems could have two, maybe three suns. That is, not a, that is not a good place to live, and if there is a civilization that lives around that, they're not going to want to be there. They're going to want to be here. If we let them know where we are, this is a bad thing. Like, they said, let's go to them single who, sun. Uh, who's the person that lets us go to break? When does that happen? <laughs> no, where are uh, them single the sun next, people? The next segment. I guess, I guess Lee doesn't want to learn today. You know what? He's going to have to learn the hard way. <laughs> no, Lee Thomas is say. totally cool. Well, walking away Thomas. from his whole and conversation. I'm walking, walking down the street. Because I don't aliens, and I'm real <laughs> yeah. loud. Sitting in my recliner, I'm like, yet. you know what they said at work today. <laughs> 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 yep, Lee Tom is totally comfortable doing that. Yep. <laughs> Well, there we go. Let's talk about uh, this virtual re reality experience, Please. courtesy of Mark Zuckerberg. <laughs> thank you, <Dad. laughs> If we can change mm. the subject, thank goodness. 